Good night, everybody. Um, was sitting in front of the TV the other day. I had my YouTube up, and my wife had gone on there and pressed the music thing, and so I was just seeing some music videos. And so I just decided to flick through them and chuckle through it, fuel them into the watch later if they looked interesting to me. Now this one, um, Slackjaw, Death Can't Save You. I have never heard of this band before. Um, I'm hoping that the sound is much better at the moment. I took that, the foam buffer off this thing because I think it was blocking the sound a little bit. Um, I'm going to keep trying things until this works. So believe me, if you're giving me feedback about the sound, I am listening and trying to get this improved. Um, I've played a little bit with the settings on my focus right, um, which is my audio input to try and make sure that this is going to be as good as possible. One of the one of the things is though that this is. Um, a very directional microphone. You've got to be right in front of it to have it really pick you up and yeah it's a dynamic mic so it's not that great at if you just want to sit back. Anyway, um, Slack Door Death Can't Save You, let's check it out. atmospheric start to it it's kind of got the start to, um, or the sound that I might have been expecting based off the, the name of the band. So it looks like it's just a three piece. Unless the thing is separate. Just wanted to take a little step back. Um, a very chunky sound. Um, then the drums of, I guess, a, a very steady backing to it. Um, some simple fills. I say simple because. Um, Not terribly impressed right at the moment, but I'm going to try and give it a bit more. Falling, your life is devolving. It's 
I like that bit. That's, I like that. Um, if you're actually listening to this with headphones, those guitar bits, it just cut to one side, then it had the drum bit, then it cut to the next side. So they really just mix the, the production and the mix in that. Um, it added a little dynamic to it that was actually um, interesting. There was, oh, there was nothing in this that was so extraordinary that makes me just jump up and love it. Um, there's enough in it to pique my interest to see what else they've done. However, if it's all like this, oh, it's just... There were little parts of it, like I liked the chord run through the chorus, where it had the drop down, then the go back up, which just added a little bit of dissonance to it, which made it interesting. And then when they had that little part where it was just all the um, distortion was gone and the guitar just did the same little thing, just the once. Um, something of interest, their breakdown or the breakdown part, was interesting because it wasn't just a chunk. I mean, because most of the song was a chunk, so they were doing something that was just a little bit different as either the, the breakdown or the bridge. I've no idea where they're from. Um... I don't know. What are your thoughts on Slack Draw? Have they been around for a while? Um, if you are a fan of Slack Draw, can you recommend me something else 
that would hopefully get me into them more as a band because at the moment I appreciate it um, there were sessions that I liked Part that part of the production was good um, but it's not something that's making me run out to uh, want to listen again to this but there's a little bit of interest in seeing what else they've got to offer I don't want to just write them off through one song because bands don't hit the mark with everything so we shall see how it pans out let me know um, thank you for hanging around if you've been here if you're still here um, greatly appreciate that if you haven't already liked, followed, subscribed, anything like that, um, would love it if you did. Thank you very much. Catch you around.